Morning out there in the DFS community. It's Vaughn, the stat man, coming into your YouTube airwaves and welcome to the stat room. All right, guys, before I tell you all the wonderfulness that happened last night with MLB, I'm going to start the, the morning off with the positive word first. Okay, I had a very interesting comment come into me. A young man asked me, how do I feel about millennials? Okay, I actually love millennials and I despise millennials. I'm going to start with why I despise millennials. All right, I despise millennials because a lot of, if you don't know what a millennial is, that, that a millennial it's a young person, someone that's 30 years old or younger, the technology age person. I despise millennials because a lot of millennials, they don't work hard. They want everything right now. They want instant gratification. That's why they, they post a picture on Snapchat. They want you to like them. They want to be liked. The millennials want to be liked. They don't believe in hard work in most cases. But, you know, that's one thing that I don't like about millennials. And a lot of millennials don't believe in giving. They want to take, 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 but they don't want to give. That's what I despise about millennials. Now, what I love about millennials is that you guys are very smart. And this is the first time in the existence of mankind where every single person can get rich without some rich person giving you permission. Because with the Internet age, anybody can sell stuff on YouTube. Anybody can sell stuff on eBay. And you guys are technologically sound. You guys understand. And a lot of the millennials are not racist. They don't really see race. You just see people as asshole or non-asshole. So I do like millennials for that part. But I'm not a millennial. I'm old school because I believe in working hard. I believe in giving people what they want and they give me what I want. I believe in win-win. You know, we both got to equally benefit. You know, and I don't mind getting up four o'clock in the morning and I don't multitask. I focus on one thing at a time. I don't believe you can multitask. I think if you multitask, then a couple things will be left kind of messed up. All right. So I hope that answers your question about millennials. I don't go right into last night's MLB. I killed an MLB, guys. I ran four different MLB contests and every single one cash. I had a 166.9, a 187.9. A 166 and a 195. Now, the one that I gave everybody, the 195, is what I gave everybody. And that was the one with Cashmere at the um, pitcher. Walters was 21.9. Goldsmith was 43.9. Murphy was 32.5. Rendon was 9.2. Owings was 25.7. Smith was 0. Tomas was 12.5. And Blackman was 34.9. So I killed in the, M in the um, MLB. I'm starting to kill. Last year, I used to get up between a 185 and 220, like six out of seven days out of the week. I used to kill an MLB. All right. And in my NBA, I had a 283 and a 291. I had um, head-to-heads. I actually took, um, for most of my contests, I mean, I only ran two. And I took, what's his name? I took Anderson out and I put in, and I put in, let me see me. I'm trying to look on my notes real quick. I took Anderson out and I put in Gibson. And that really, I guess that must have paid off because I look back and Anderson gave up 5.9 points, but Gibson gave way more than that. So I, I won both my head-to-head -head NBA contests. I don't know what you guys did because I didn't run any other kind of contest for NBA. All right, so I'm going to get right into the four horsemen for today. I'm on to today, guys. All right, so for point guard, I'm going with John Wall. Shooting guard, I'm going with Green from Boston. Small forward, I'm going with Butler. And power forward, I'm going with Bobby Portis from Chicago. All right, guys, so I'm killing MLB right now. Um, I've learned now with NBA, I've been winning with the head-to-heads, guys, so I think I'm going to stick with the head-to-heads. Um, yeah, that's what, I, that's what I did last night. And, and like I said, I had 1,000 subscribers, so I love you guys for that. And if you guys like what I did this fine morning, it's four o'clock in the a.m. This is winning time, four o'clock in the morning. Um, hit the like button, subscribe to me. And guys, always come back to the comment section and view it because I post stuff in there. Sometimes I'm feeling generous and I'll just post the MLB lineup in there. And if I do post anything free, I'll post it all between five and six. All right, I'm going to leave it there, guys. So if you have any questions, I'll definitely answer them. And love you guys. Enjoy your morning.